Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you everything that is going to be in my daughter's stocking. Um, I wanted to do this video a little quicker than what I got her for Christmas because that video I ended up being a mess all over so I'm trying to be very organized with this and so I wanted to show you everything that I got for her that's going to go in her stocking this year. So first to start off, I have this really giant coloring book pad. Um, got it at Walmart. Obviously it doesn't fit in the stocking, so it's just going to go right next to it. But it's got um, a bunch of the different characters. You can't really see all of them. All the princesses. And my daughter over the last maybe four or five months has really gotten into princesses and all dressing up like them and everything so I thought that would be really fun because she really likes to color and it would just be a fun opportunity for her to color something a lot bigger than just a small coloring book or plain paper and so then the next thing that I got are these little pomsy poos I I don't know exactly what they are but they go around your wrist and you wear them like a bracelet I guess um, I found them at Kohl's just super cheap um, so I got her the kitty and then I got her the unicorn and she saw them already and she really liked them and she kind of forgot about them so I'm putting them in her stocking next thing I got for her is some um, frozen band-aids she is addicted to band-aids no matter what if she barely hits herself on something she wants a band-aid so she's going through like a box of band-aids a week so um, I got these because obviously she loves Anna and Elsa and Frozen and she loves band-aids so I don't know I guess maybe what three-year-old doesn't oh I forgot to mention that too is my daughter will be three about a week and a half after Christmas so I'm kind of considering her three for the purpose of this video um, but every child is different so some of this stuff may not work for everybody's child so just so let's put that out there um, next I got her one of these packs of stickers this I believe I got at the dollar store and it's got puffy stickers glitter stickers all sorts of different princess stickers obviously she loves stickers just as much as coloring and band-aids so um, I wanted to get her a bunch more stickers so that she could kind of do whatever she wanted with them. The next thing is, um, I got one of these little frozen mystery ball things. Um, I don't know what's inside of it. I've never seen anybody open one. So I just, I saw it and I thought it might be a fun little something to put in her stocking. I'm not trying to go overboard with the frozen stuff this year because I know she likes it. The same with the princess stuff but I want to get her a variety of things so you'll see that but I got her that and to go with the giant coloring book I got her some of these large crayons that are washable they're 16 this is you know a big box and I actually really like these bigger crayons because I think they'll work better for my daughter she does fine with the small crayons but they break really easily and they end up all over the house so I thought if they're bigger maybe they'll break less and she can actually color with them so I got her those, and I also got her, um, I think there's another one of these in the box, um, these little tiny notepads. Um, I use these when I take notes or bring a list to Walmart or something, and she's always taking out all the pages and coloring on them, and I don't have any left, so I thought if I got her her own, she would stop taking mine. So there's a little tiny notebook. I think there's another one in here too. And um, I got her... Um, these two silks are from Etsy. They're little play silks. Um, one is yellow and one is kind of a purple color. They were seconds because the dyeing process didn't take, so they're kind of a little bit different on the color there, but I think they're super pretty. So those two are from Etsy. And then I got her these five from Amazon, but they're from Sarah's Silk, obviously. Um... And I don't remember the names of the colors, but there's, uh, you know, a dark blue, green. This is like the watercolor one, so it's like a multicolor one. It's not the rainbow one, but it's just the blues and greens. And then I got her a purple and like a burgundy red. 
Um, I'm really trying to introduce, she's doing a lot of imaginative play lately and a lot of kind of just whatever. So I wanted to get her something fun and I've always wanted to get her these silks and so I've been slowly getting them off of Amazon one by one. So I got those. And then, um, oh, here is the other little notebook. I got her one of these magic ink pads. That's another Disney princess one. Um, I, she really likes, we have some of those magic marker, I forget what they're called, but they come with the books and the five markers in the, pa in the plastic package. Um, she really likes those and I like that they don't get everywhere and she can take them in the car or wherever we're going. So I actually, I'm going to give this to her and then we're probably going to keep it in our bag when we go out to eat or something like that. Cause it'll be a good something that she can use out there. Um, I got her, an, oh, there's another package of stickers. Anna and Elsa, these are from the dollar store again. And then I got her two movies. Got her Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs and Ferdinand. She really likes these movies. Um, and she's, she's kind of, she likes movies, not that she watches them all the time. But she likes to watch, you know, different stuff. And I just thought, I found those at Walmart one of them was only $1.99, and the other one I think was like $2.97. So it wasn't too much money, and plus my husband likes to watch a movie too. So it works for both of them. Another thing I got for her is, I got this at the dollar store. It's the little um, glow stick lanterns. I plan on not using it as a lantern, but just the multicolored glow sticks. Um, we've, we were went to a couple parties this last summer, and they had these little glow sticks, and she loved them. So I thought if I could get a package with a bunch of different colors, it would be more fun for her. So that's why I got this one. If she wants to put it in the lantern, I guess she could. Um, but I just got it because it had the different colors. Otherwise, you have to buy just one color at a time. So I got her that. And also from the dollar store, she kind of picked these out. And I just decided to put them in her stocking. Um, our An Anna and an Elsa headband. Um, she does not have that much hair. So headbands work out perfect for her because it gives her something to wear without trying to put a bunch of clippies and things in there to hold her hair together. Um, the next thing that I got for her, I know it may look weird, but it is a tarantula schlick um, figurine. She likes spiders a lot, talks about them all the time. She likes to hold them, not real life ones, but like these kind. She'll hold on to it for hours and hours and hours. So I got her that. The next thing I got for her is this kind of hand maneuver toy thing. I got this at a local toy store. And it's just something that maybe she can play with in the car or something like that. It will be kind of fun to do. And it's different colors and it moves around and it becomes a block. And then you can make it bigger or longer. It's got like elastic bands inside. You really can't see them. But that... And then I also got her, I'll show you, I got her three little things of kinetic sand. I did show you guys in the video for her actual present that she's getting bigger things of kinetic sand for a sensory bin. These smaller ones I plan on ending up putting in like a diaper bag or my purse or something so when we go someplace she has a little fun something to do. I got her the purple, the green, and the blue. And I thought that they would be a fun, fun something to use when we go out because she's, she's starting to get to where she gets more bored when we go out to eat and I'm trying to have different things to do that are not electronic. And so I want to be able to have different fun things that I can pull out that maybe she doesn't see every day and it'll keep her more entertained. And the next thing I got, I got these off of Amazon were, um, I think it's 10 pairs of clip on earrings. She loves earrings. She has two pairs, I think, and she's lost one set so far. And she really likes to wear them with all her princess dresses. So I was looking everywhere trying to find clip-on earrings. And I looked on Amazon and I finally found a set that I liked that actually had quite a few pairs, different styles, different colors that she can choose from. And that were clip-on because she does not have her ears pierced. So um, I found that. And I think this is only like 8 or $9. So it's pretty good for 10 pairs of earrings. And then the last thing I got for her, also off of Amazon, but I know you can get them at a lot of places, 
was one of these um, thread the cheese um, little things. I think it's, you know, it's one of those things that could be really fun when, like I said, when you go out to eat or when you're in the car running errands. Um, long road trips or sitting in church or something like that. Um, but I I think these are really fun. I've been eyeballing one of these for a really long time. And so I really wanted to get her that so that she could have some fun stuff for the car for when we go out to eat, that kind of thing. So anyways, the video is getting quite long and I just wanted to show you guys everything I got. I know there's a lot of stuff here, but I just think it's a lot of fun to get these little things. And like I said, half this stuff is going to end up in, you know, in our car or in a bag to go out to eat. It's good stuff for that kind of thing. Um, so anyways, I just wanted to show you guys all of this stuff. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, comment below. Let me know what kind of stuff you guys put in your stockings. Um, I, I did want to show you guys what I put in my husband's, but he watches my videos, so I don't want him to see what I'm putting in his stocking. I also wanted to do a video of what I'm getting him for Christmas, but since he watches my videos, I don't want him to know beforehand. So anyways, that is everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed and gives you some great ideas and we'll see you next time.